Welcome to Morning Man with Pastor Steve Myrie. This morning's topic, Equal Ground. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Romans 3, 23. For no one person needs the blood of Jesus more than the other. Jesus died once and for all. Humanity must come to God on equal terms. Each individual totally helpless to earn his or her way to him. When we come to him with this attitude, he raises us up by the blood of Jesus Christ. <laughs> he doesn't raise us up because we do good things. He raises us up because we have faith in the finished work on the cross. Many in the church today were striving with holiness. What we were striving to perfect had already fallen and would only be restored at the second coming of the Lord. We were trying to perfect the flesh. Flesh is in enmity against God, whether we paint it up that way or not. The church frequently has, and still does, major underminers. When that begins to happen, it is a sign that the church has lost touch with the world and with the inspiration of the Lord. It is no longer reaching out to the lost. A church that focuses on the external has lost its passion for souls. When we come into that position, we have attained a pseudo-holiness. It's false. What is holiness? To understand it, we must first separate the pseudo from the genuine. Because when you come into a church, it is possible to walk away feeling like a second-class citizen. When you start going overboard trying to be a super spiritual person, in order to compensate for an embarrassing past, you can't earn deliverance. You have to just receive it by faith. Christ is the only righteousness that God will accept. If your outward sanctity had impressed God, Christ would have endorsed the Pharisees. One of the things that this pandemic has brought to light is the fact that there is a real church and that there is a false one. The Bible says that was the time when God will seek true worshipers who will worship Him in spirit and in truth. Now is not the time for the church to be seeking clout, trying to go viral. Now is the time when we should be encouraging each other in Christ and pointing sinners to the Lord. I encourage you today, do not allow this coronavirus and all that is happening cause you to turn away from the Lord. And as well, I encourage the unsaved, do not just come to the Lord because of the fear of corona, but come to Him because you love Him. The quote of the day, Humanity must come to God on equal terms, each individual totally helpless to earn his or her way to Him. Now go today, walk in confidence, understanding it's not because you are pretty, it's not because you are handsome, but you're saved by grace. 